Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a pack with me video because I'm going to Colorado for the whole summer. And so super exciting. I just did my laundry and I'm folding it all up and then I'm gonna show you guys like what I'm taking with me. I'm definitely an overpacker, so it's gonna be a lot. I'm just gonna say it, okay? I'm gonna put a lot in and it's gonna be fine. Last summer I underpacked, so I'm trying not to do that again, but I'm still trying to be minimal. Well, let's just jump into the vid Okay, bye. So I just got up and it's like 9.07. Well, I got up at like 8.45. But my church is giving out the Eucharist today. So I'm super excited because it's like the first time I've gotten to receive the Eucharist in like two months because of Corona. And then, okay, that's it, goodbye. I just got to receive the Eucharist for the first time in like two months and I'm crying. It was wonderful. It was kind of weird. The priest was in a mask, like a coverage mask, and then it was outside, so you had to like walk down this plastic aisle thing. It was great, so yay. projects with Focus Catholic and it's basically a faith formation intensive program where you work all summer but you also have spiritual direction, you receive the sacraments, daily mass, all that kind of stuff. So super exciting, super fun. I'm really just excited to like grow my faith and to meet new people and to make new friends. It's gonna be a lot of fun but yeah. I'm gonna just show you what I'm putting in my bag because I find that interesting when I see other people's packing stuff. Yeah, I'm trying to do like a bunch of staples so I can like mix them around, put them like together differently, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna do that today and then I'll probably do my cosmetics and stuff later on, either this week or today because I leave on Friday and it's Wednesday. So I need them for a few more days. And then also with like soaps and stuff, I'm just gonna buy them when I get to Colorado because I'm going up a week early to visit my sister. But that's all I've got going today. So stick around if you wanna see what I put in my suitcase. Okay, so this is what I have at the moment. I'm gonna have to bring this comforter thing. So I squish it up into a little freezer bag, freezer bag, putting it in the freezer. I separated all of my clothes that I'm gonna pack, that I think I'm gonna pack at least, into a pile. So I have nicer clothes here, pajamas, and then I'm doing like, this is literally just one flannel. And then these are like my work pants, and then some jeans. I don't, this is so many jeans. I need to reduce that, okay, I'm going to. And then I have a few pairs of shorts, like these are nicer shorts, and then I also put like athletic shorts five t-shirts a few sweater things this is a nicer sweater because i was like i don't know maybe i'll need that but we'll see and so far for shoes i just put my burks in and then heels kind of for like my church outfits if i need it if it's colder and then my af ones and then i'm gonna put i have hoka tennis shoes that i'm bringing too and then i wear like a regular pair of burks every day that i'll also bring some chacos probably nicer clothes for church and stuff i brought or i'm bringing this little gingham dress it's super cute it's from goodwill my sister found it and then I'm bringing this little white dress. It's like an eyelid dress swings. I don't know. I can't reach but and then my all-time fave jumpsuit and it polka dot and then it's shorter. I don't know if you can see it. A t-shirt under it or a jacket over it, a sweater over it or you can just wear it plain. It's super versatile and I love it. That's what I'm bringing for like my nice church clothes. As far as jeans go, I decided I'm only gonna bring three. I had like five pairs to begin with, but I'm cutting it down. So I'm bringing these for like my nicer jeans and these are from Gap. And then I got these from Target. These little ribs in them and then just little bottoms. Cute. So comfy too. And then I'm bringing these jeans too. These are also from Target, but I ripped the holes in these because we love holy jeans. Holy girl, holy jeans, you know what it is. And that's all I'm bringing for my jean pants. As far as like jean shorts go, I'm bringing these. Hold on. I'm bringing these ones. These I got at St. Vincent de Paul thrift store, I think. These from Target. These kind of, when you put them on, they look like those little bloomer shorts that babies wear. I don't know, but I dig them. For athletic shorts, I'm just bringing these little orange Nikes and then black 
blue and then green ones my brown these are from target too they're just kind of like those jean shorts but they're they're super wrinkly right now but yeah they're from target i'm obsessed with tops and sweaters this is a sweatshirt from target it's just like an orange one and it has these cute little bell sleeves this little patagonia have zip this is also from target striped pullover thing it's from h&m it's just brown oversized sweater that i wear over like a t-shirt or something okay i'm tired of lifting stuff up so for pajamas i'm bringing these little star pants they're kind of joggers and then i got these off of amazon from big little reveal and then i'm bringing these little cheetah shorts too this cute little jean jacket that i'm gonna bring too the work pants i have like a few pairs it's like three pairs of joggers and then two pairs of leggings i probably won't use the leggings unless i'm like on a flight or traveling or something but yeah those are what that's for and then i'm bringing this flannel i forgot to show my t-shirts t-shirts i'm bringing this flowery top from old navy mercy tea my friend ansley got it for me from shout out ansley yeah i got it from sls question mark staple tees like this i'm bringing a bunch of these i have like one in this color one in this gray that'll probably bring that too and then i have two from old navy very fun let me throw that in there first so look how much space this comforter took up i'm screaming Yay! Everything fit so perfect. That's crazy. And then when I pop it shut, look, perfect. I still have to put all my cosmetics and stuff in though, but I think I might put that in another bag just because it might be easier to keep track of. Does packing make like anybody else severely overheated? Is that just me? I don't know. I hope not. I just feel very, very hot right now and have to take a break. My heart rate is up. I'm feeling exhausted. I packed my bag, but then I remembered I needed to put these nicer shirts in there just in case. But they're super small, so it should be fine. But I have this one, and it ties at the bottom. She's so cute! Fun, 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 fun. Okay, I think this is all I'm gonna put in this bag, and then I'm gonna put, or I'm gonna get another suitcase that's like smaller, carry-on one, and put my, my other essentials in it. I pulled out this suitcase. This is my second one. I put, an extra sweatshirt in there and then another t-shirt just in case and then those are some black jeans that I have to have for work I'm bringing this Patagucci a rain jacket this sweatshirt too just in case it's colder it looks like it's super full but there's not there's just a sweatshirt under it and I haven't pushed it down and I'm gonna put my cosmetic stuff in here and then probably like my straightener and hair dryer somewhere in this one Okay, so I'm sticking most of my cosmetic stuff in here that I'm going to put in my luggage. But I'm going to stick my toothbrush in. And then I have some contacts. Those are like two extra pairs, I think. I'm putting in deodorant. And then I have this little BioClarity face wash. And this like Revival Gel stuff. And then I have some facial mist that I'm sticking in there. Nothing's focusing. I'm sorry. And then I'm putting this moisturizer, also not focusing, awesome. And then I have this giant bag of like random makeup and everything in between. So I'm just going to fill this makeup bag with my makeup. And then if I find anything else to put in my cosmetic bag, I'll do that. So I'm going to put this styling stuff in there. And then my Ratchet Sale Neutrogena Concealer. Poof, 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 poof. Shadow Cameron for giving me that eyeshadow. This is gonna go in here in my little Morphe palette. I probably won't use that at all, but we'll see. Put these little hair ties in here too. And then mascara can go in. I need to get a new mascara because that one's super old. And then I'll put this blush that I have. And Beauty Blender, Nasserity. Also my little eyebrow pencil from e.l.f. because I'm cheap and only by e.l.f. Okay, and that's all for cosmetics. Obviously, I'll stick in my contact solution and all that stuff the day I leave because I need it for I need it right now. But I'm gonna just stick these in here like so and pray that this fits. If not, we'll make it work. For all of my prayer stuff, I'm bringing this summer. I'm bringing my rosary, 
And then these daily missiles with the mass readings in them. Searching for and maintaining peace by Father Jock Fleep. I heard it's super good. In my journal. And then I'm bringing this book by C.S. Lewis. It's his. So this is his conversion story. I read about half of it. So I was going to try to finish it. Maybe on a plane or something. And then <laughs> if I get around to this. 33 days to morning glory. It's a consecration to Mary. Uh, I've done it before. But it's hard so i'm gonna see if maybe i do it this summer i don't know but yeah i'll be putting all of that in this backpack and then also stick in like my cameras my computer and just some little knickknacks like pens and pencils and other stuff like that i ended up putting my extra stuff that was in that pink suitcase in this bag because i was going to use it as a carry-on but then it just had a lot of extra room so i just decided to pack it full and to not bring a carry-on so i'm just going to bring my backpack and yeah i think that's all i'm doing <laughs>